That official FBI business? What? That the Bureau is accusing you of the same thing in Dallas. Standing around holding your yank while bombs are exploding. Do I know you? No, but I've been watching your career for a good while. Back when you were just a promising young agent. Before that. You come out here for a reason? Yeah, I did. My name is Kurzweil. Dr. Alvin Kurzweil. Am I supposed to know that name? Old friend of your father's. Back at the Department of State, we were what you might call fellow travelers. But his disenchantment outlasted mine. Right. I'll go ahead and get number four. How'd you find me? I heard you come in here now and again. Figured you'd be needing a little drinky tonight. You're a reporter. I'm a doctor, but I think I mentioned that. OBGYN. You got something to tell me? You got as much time as it takes for me to hail a cab. There's something you don't know about the bombing in Dallas. What's that? SAC Darius Michaud never tried or intended to defuse that bomb. I just let it explode in his face, huh? What's the question no one's asking? Why that building? Why not the federal building? The federal building was too well guarded. No. They put the bomb in the building across the street because it did have federal officers there. The Federal Emergency Management Agency had a provisional medical quarantine office there, which is where the bodies were found. But that's the thing, the thing you didn't know, the thing you'd never think to check. Those people were already dead. Before the bomb went off. That's what I'm saying. Darius Michaud was a 22-year veteran of the Bureau. Michaud was a patriot. The people he was loyal to know their way around Dallas. They blew that building to hide something, maybe even something they couldn't predict. You're telling me they blew up that entire building just to hide the bodies of those firemen? And one little boy. I think you're full of shit. <laughs> Do you? Arlington, please. Actually, you know, uh, let's go to Georgetown. Let's go to Georgetown. <laughs> 